Hi, John here. I'm just having my lunch, Kinners. See? Over here. Kinners. See? I just went up to Mangari to get some Kinners. And you see how to eat them? You take it out like that, the row. The row. These ones are really, really nice. They're really, really nice. Look at that. Look at that. Now you see it? Now you don't. Mm-mm. Good. Good coffee. I make four of these. One of that fish. Let me um. Mullet, mullet, it's hot, hot, I've got the fan going. I'll give me a mullet, clean up and fry them later. I only got a little one, which is only me, it's only me to eat that. I went to Mungary Town Centre on the bus for go kart holders. That's my mullet. Later, you got and in its own oil. Then I got fish heads. Whole heap of fish heads, not big ones, but they're right. Fish heads. In here, I'm going to boil them up with onions. Here. Let me go to recording now. See, just for my brain. I like peas. I put my name down for fish heads where they give them away. But it's just as fish heads. Here. Yeah. There, yeah, fish heads. Snap up fish heads. Beautiful. You want to have big brains, eat this stuff. Eat mouth, fish heads, and kinners. And you'll end up with big brains. Okay? I got some more in the fridge, some more kinners, I got heaps more. But they're nice, they're really nice. I like to eat everything in the kinner, the whole lot. Yes. When you're hard up for kinners, and they cost a dollar something at each, you eat everything, including the water. So I cut them in a bowl. for your heart. See, I died. Mm -hmm. When I died for ten up before, seaweed, look, eat seaweed. Ten up eat seaweed. It's still gone. Mm -mm. The Mungary Town Centre Fish Shop had a bin for them. Bin for them. I could have bought the whole bin. Richard, that's my boy. Eat your honey. You have to start done clean. Mm-mm. I eat all the sea eggs in it too. There's a room. 
I'll never eat. Everything in the kennel. But in the back kennel, we eat the whole lot. So we've got a mullet. The mullet. Okay. The onions are good with pretty. The mullet cooked on its own. I just generally fry it by itself. It would be good to buy it cooked over there. That top is nice because you can sit down and eat a mullet for eight dollars. That's the water. But clean you up. Better than the doctor. And the cake? I think so. Cake? Loaf pineapple. $1.99. That's what I like about that. I shot up here. That's the cake. So I'll put this in here. Before they go. That's what I call internet food. Internet food. Do you know what? No, I think I'll demolish now. I'll say I'm going to say some for later. Some for later. Got them in, I got them in a, in a tray in here. And I'll show you uh, an aerial view of what a wrecking yard looks like down there. Kenneth. There, wrecking yard. The Kenneth had uh, demolished just a while ago. Okay? So we've got. Oranges over there, heaps of oranges over there. I have to tidy up here. Oranges everywhere. I love oranges, but I just want to say that my friend um, in Philippines. Hey, hey, where's my name? And uh, tomatoes in here. All good stuff. I weighed myself, I weighed myself at the gym a minute ago. I took a video up here as well. And I was 85. I've gone up one. Oh, one, I've gained one kilogram. But I'm eating properly. And I'm not getting weight on because I'm being very careful how I eat, how much I eat. And I have lots of oranges. I'll eat about six oranges a day. And when I went to buy some more, they were all gone. And big box fill up, gone. You know why? Because they were $1.99 a kilo. That's why I bought all the. I bought all the tuna. I bought, I bought all the oranges too. Yeah. I got something in the mail. I think it's what I think it is. My heart, my heart monitor. Another one. So I've got, I've got a few monitors for my heart, and it's been not bad. I took my reading this morning. I'll tell you what it is. See, I'm keeping an eye. I'm keeping an eye on my heart. I'll tell you what it is. I weighed myself as 85 kg. But normally I wanted 84 or 83. So I'm happy about that because I haven't been to the gym for a while. And I'm looking alright. So this morning's readings at 724 Fitbit 
this one here was 57, that's pretty good. That's below 65 beats a minute. And uh, uh, my oxy, that's the thing on my finger, that's this one in here, this one on the finger, there, that was 58.95, and on the second finger, 62.94, and on the right finger, 69.97, and on the second finger, 59.96, and my heart, um, this one, on the arm, that one, the one on the arm, that one on the arm, went up to um, 208, and that reading was 163.93. Um, Nine and sixty-five. That's high. The Fitbit was sixty-one times seven thirty. So it took six minutes to do that test, and one hundred sixty-three should be one hundred forty-seven. Over ninety-nine should be eighty-two. Over sixty-five should be sixty. So it's still high, but hey, I'm enjoying myself um, at that level. Okay, I I, <coughs> I had no trouble. High blood pressure. So just keep an eye on it, that's all. Now let's see what's in here. I think it's my wrist, wrist um, monitor. Wrist monitor. Oh no, that's it. What's this? Oh no, my shirt. They have sent my shirt back from the police station. Ah! They sent my shirt back from the police station. I've got this on camera now. Look, I'm opening it. I'm opening the letter. It's just come in my mail to... It's John 1R, 7B, 16 Park Avenue, Odahu. Courier says, what courier? My shirt is in here. And it's, I'm making this for the record. Subject's name 01, Wanoa, W A N O A in capital. Right? Take a note of this. I'll make a separate video afterwards of this. On this day, Thursday, Friday, the 24th of November 2017, I've received my shirt has come back. I didn't pick it up, I left it there for evidence, so I'm leaving it for evidence against the police right here as Exhibit A in my quartering for 77 Cook Street 15093068444 and that's the first number of the file number and OC's details signature I didn't sign to pick it up, it got some mailed out F35 bar 139 that's just the exhibit Okay, couriers there, and the receipt of receiving it from the store, chain of custody, 2nd of December 2015, 4th of the 11th, 2017, 20, no, 20 1st of the 11th of November 2017. That's when somebody signed it off and sent it back to me. Received by Alan Rickards, somebody, RTO stores. So they've sent it back to me. Property record sheet. New Zealand Police exhibit number. 1535 bar 139. I'm going to use this in a court hearing in Tūnga Wakamarae to seize Cook Street. I'm going to send these to the um, private investigator as evidence against Natalie Flower Dew Brown. I'll take an another video after because this is very crucial that I 
have a separate video for this for the record. I'll read this afterwards, but this is a property record sheet from the New Zealand Police received today on the 24th. They sent it on the 21st, and I received it on the 24th. So I'll make another recording afterwards, but I only want to show you my lunch and my cameras, and um, we'll do that afterwards. So thank you very much. We'll see you later, and very soon. Bye.